Hi everyone, Alva Syke here. I have a video for you today that um, I've named Regret, Doing versus Not Doing. And uh, this is for informational purposes only. I've taken most of the information from a book called The Paradox of Choice by Barry Schwartz, uh, 2004, and also The Myths of Happiness by Sonia Lubomirsky, uh, 2013. And of course, I tend to throw my two cents in as well. Now, the first part um, I've actually um, taken directly from the paradox of choice. I'm going to read this. Okay. So the, you need to understand how this little uh, vignette goes. So listen carefully. Uh, Mr. Paul owned shares in Company A. During the past year, he considered switching to stock in Company B, but he decided against it. He now finds out that he would have been better off by $1,200 if he had switched to the stock of Company B. Now, Mr. George owned shares in Company B, and during the past year, he switched to stock in Company A. He now finds that he would have been better off by $1,200 if he had kept his stock company B. So, who feels the greater regret? So both Mr. Paul and Mr. George are in the same position. They both would have $1,200 more if they had owned shares in company B. But 92% of respondents said they thought Mr. George would feel worse than Mr. Paul. The, the key def difference here is that Mr. George did something. He switched from company B to company A, while Mr. Paul uh, did not do anything. He did not switch uh, to company B. That's called the omission bias, and we tend to downplay omissions or failures to act. Or do we? Okay, this is where things get a little interesting. Now, when people look back, say, six months or more down the down the road people tend to have more regret for not doing things for a failure to act so failure to act seems to have a bigger impact on regret than not acting okay did that make sense i hope <laughs> uh, so this falls in line with sonia lubomirsky's uh uh, information in her book, uh, The Myths of Happiness. Uh, she writes, it's easier to rationalize actions than inactions. It's easier to undo actions, but more difficult to res resolve inactions. Regrets over inactions tend to magnify. So, there you have it. Less regret over time if you act versus not acting. Apparently missed opportunities hit harder than acting and getting an unfavorable outcome. Okay, that's it. Thanks.